I'm like, I just saw we were both gonna try things. It's a Thursday. A beer breath. Oh. Star Hill Brewery Red Reviver Red IPA, Charlottesville, Virginia. For a long day of work, I think I might need a little reviver myself. <laughs> Usually I go with coffee, but it's a good opportunity to try a little try a little beer. Yeah. Yeah? It's definitely reviving me. <laughs> this is making me feel some type of way. Oh. You know? Like it's making like me... Like you want to break the law or... <laughs> Get crazy! Why isn't like a bunny rabbit a mascot for an IPA? Because that's the mascot for cereal. 6.2 APV, ABV, alcohol by volume. I should have had some lunch. Actually, we'll say I do quite like that. Yeah, that's my favorite. This is from the Lost Rhino Brewing Company. It's a Rhino Chasers Pilsner. Yes, yeah, so Rhino Chasers. I think surfing Rhino is the way to go on this one. This is Pilsner. <laughs> I hardly know her. Yeah, this tastes like. It doesn't taste as. Yeah, it's like good. It's a little bit lighter. It's more, yeah, I feel like that would be a really, that's really good summer beer. Oh yeah. Yep. Summer. Give what me, happens if they <laughs> find the rhino? Yeah, it tastes a little less peppery, but like very bright. It has like a very like bright flavor to it. This is easy. This is an easy drink. I could drink this in the summer outside. The defense rests. Schwartz beer. Look at that Schwartz. German style black lager. And they've spelled beer in the non-traditional B I E R. Ooh. Very nice. You know it's German because of how they spell beer. This is gonna be a dark one. Oh. Oh like root beer. Wow. Yeah. Doesn't smell like root beer. Doesn't smell like root beer. I like the looks of that. Schwartz beer. Schwartz. Um, I like their bottle art. Cool. The stallion. Oh, it's a horse. Maybe this is the dark horse beer oh. of the ones that were sampling. Oh, that this is my favorite. Seems like this is also hoppy, but don't really know what I'm judging. Ooh, it smells good. It's dark and roasty. <laughs> this is nice. I, mean, I, I couldn't have three or four of these after I cut the grass. Yeah. <laughs> otherwise, Just not your mustache. Otherwise, I'd be on the deck. Ow. We got the double D. Oh, that's an IPA. So IPAs are supposed to be very sort of um, hoppy. Is it hoppy? Yeah. Okay. I don't really know what that means, though. I a double IPA, India Pale Ale. That, that, does, that does not look like approved flying gear by the U.S. Air Force. Can you fly a plane in heels? I never have. <laughs> oh, this is so hoppy. It does have a nice... I mean, it's really sturdy. It's got a nice flavor. A India Pale Ale. This is good. I think hoppy means... Like, you mean super bubbly? I keep staring at it like it's gonna do something to me. Are you a, are you a cider drinker? I am a cider drinker. Uh, today we're gonna be trying the Bold Rock Hard Cider. It's a Virginia draft. This is one of my favorites. <laughs> I'm gonna pour for myself first, because I'm a gentleman. Are we supposed to sniff or swirl? <sighs> Slaunch up. Yeah, this is good. Yeah, this is side school. Tastes like apple juice. Yeah, it tastes like um, like an apple met yeah. a beer and they got along really well. Bold rock. It's definitely bold. I'm not sure I can taste the rock. This belongs in our juice, juice box. Uh, Northern Lights, you want to try that? Sure. Yeah. This is from the Star Hill Brewery. It's the Northern Lights IPA. Only brewed um, uh, when the aurora borealis is visible. Not <laughs> good. This is tasty. Is that your favorite? Yeah, that's my favorite. The Northern Lights IPA. Yeah, Northern Lights is a winner. <laughs> I would drink this socially. Would you? <laughs> that's her favorite. I'm gonna take this one for the road. I don't know if I'm very funny. I know you're not. <laughs> <laughs>